Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Before we start, answer me this. Have you ever checked weather on your smartphone? And I think all of you do that, right? But do you know how it works? Or can you build a device which can tell you the weather? And I think many of us would have thought about that. And that's why I am gonna build this device which will show me the weather information of my city. So guys, today we will build the ESP8266 based weather station which will fetch the weather information from the internet. So without wasting any more further time, let's do this. <laughs> Hi guys, this video is sponsored by PCBGoGo.com, the manufacturer of good quality professional PCBs. So in order to get your professional PCBs, please visit the link in description and get your professional PCBs from PCBGoGo.com. So guys, before we start, make sure you have ESP8266 NodeMs U-Boot and you have installed ESP8266 boards in your Arduino IDE. So the basic idea is to program ESP8266 board in a way so that it can perform a HTTP request and fetch the weather data from a server. And in this case we will be getting data from openweathermap.org. So openweathermap.org provides API services and we can make API calls to open weather map API and get the weather information. So basically go to open weather map website and sign up. Then visit their API links page and get your own API key. Now please copy this URL and put your city name, country code and your API key. And when you will try to access this URL, you will be able to see some response. This data is basically weather information of your city. But it is in JSON format. So to process this format data and convert it into a readable format data, we will use a JSON library. So install Arduino JSON library in your Arduino IDE. After this connect your node MCU to your PC then download my code from video description. Now in code put your Wi-Fi SSID and password then put your API key here and then put your city name and country code here. And if you want to see if your city is listed in their website then go to their website and explore the map and check the data for your city and the country. Now just upload the code to your board and then open the serial monitor and you can see that we are getting temperature, pressure, humidity and wind speed. Looks like our weather monitor is working. Now let's add the display to this project so that we can read our weather information on the display. And I'll be using ST7735 TFT display module. So I will be connecting this display to our node MCU according to the shown schematics. So now I connected everything and modified my code for this display. But we need to add few libraries for this display in our Arduino IDE. So make sure that you have added ST7735 display library to your Arduino IDE. And if Adafruit GFX library is also not there. Please install that too. Then upload the code to your board. And if everything is fine, then you will be able to see weather information on your display. Looks cool, right? But we are not done yet. We have to connect this all together by making a PCB. So I designed a proper PCB for this project. And you can find the Gerber files for this PCB in video description. And then you can order your professional PCBs by going to PCBGoGo.com. 
and you can upload your Gerber files and order your professional PCBs. Well, I already received my PCBs. So let's connect it all together. And as you can see, it was very easy and I connected it all together. Now let's connect the power to this board and in some time you'll be able to see the weather information of your city in this display. And now you can go to their website to verify this data. Or you can just use your smartphone to verify this weather information from the Google. So guys, let me know about this project in comment section. And let me know if I have to make a better version of this weather station. So guys, that's all for today. I hope you like this video. If you do, hit like, give me a share and don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys in another video of mine. Till then, keep exploring.